What's good, guys? If you're looking for cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure I head over my sponsor. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout for the most cheapest, most fastest, most quickest, reliable source on the internet right now. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K22 Minds video, guys. We're going to go over every single token market player in the game that I have. Well, I can look at at least. I don't think I can go over the Galaxy over, but yeah, I'm going to look at every single token market player in the game. I'm going to tell you guys what's worth it. I know all the YouTubers are doing like Emerald first, then Sapphire, then Ruby. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go over every single one on who I like, whose jump shots I like, and what I think is the right move. So let's go over it, baby. Let's go. All right, token market. First off, you didn't enter this locker code. It's right here. On um, the locker code was my last video. Make sure to go check that out. Um, make sure definitely go check that out. So I have three lock codes in the other video. Anyways, where the hell's the word? Uh, token market should be over. Am I dumb or stupid or dumb? Guys. There we go. Don't know why it's under rewards. Okay. So, here's all the token players. Um, we got Barry, Chris, Darren Collision, Jared Dudley, John Henson, Jackson. All right. So, look at all these, right? Looking at the stats, I'm going to say this. Andre Robertson is worth nothing. He is dog water. All right. Rodney Rogers is a dog. Rodney Rogers is going to make your team a great team. And now why is that, you may ask? Because defense isn't good. Oh, trust me. Defense is not good no matter what at this stage of the game. You want to focus on, in this game right now, you want to focus on three-point shooting. If you have the better three-point shooters, you're going to win the games. This man, Roger Mason's a dog. This man, Jaron Jackson, is a dog. All the people that can shoot threes is what you want. Marquise Chris, also a dog. Um, he cannot shoot threes, but he's really athletic. I would recommend him. So, Rick Barry or John Barry also could shoot trades. So, I'm going John Barry. How many you need out of here? Five of these? Five of these. So, five. Barry. I'm going with Barry. I'm going with Jackson. I'm going with Mason. And I'm going with my man Rogers. And then I guess for the fifth, I'll go Chris in there for some... Jared Dudley's also not bad. It's up to you. But Jared Dudley's pretty decent as well. Defenses, they're all trash. But it's in between Dudley or Chris. So that's what I think. Bang. Sapphires, definitely Seth Curry. He's dirty. Um, Seth Curry's definitely be the man. I would definitely get Seth Curry. Um, so who else we got in here? Dad Young's pretty cool. Kelly Oubre is definitely be a fan favorite. I would definitely pick him. Patty Mills is really cheesy. He he's always cheesy in 2K in the beginning. I would definitely pick up a Mr. Patty Mills. Um, he could shoot. Definitely a beast. Who's this guy? Could he shoot? Can't shoot. What, what is he, a center? Definitely don't want that. He's a center. He can't shoot. How tall is he? 6'11", not good enough. Jermaine Jones, he can't shoot either. Ah, actually, wait a second. He can shoot pretty decently. 79-3, really good defense. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this guy's a, this guy's a steal. Um, this guy's a steal. You put a little bit of a boost on him, he's going to be a beast. He can dunk, he can shoot, and he can play defense. This guy's the best Sapphire one. It's not even close. So he is the best Sapphire one. It's not even close. Phil Jackson can't shoot. Defense is terrible. He is worthless. All right. Phil Jackson is worthless. Trent Hassel. The man can't shoot at all. His defense isn't good enough. Definitely not picking him. Kent Bazemore is a dog. I would pick Kent Bazemore. Good defense. Good offense. Steal. And Seth Curry, obviously, is going to shoot from range. I don't think he has range. If he has any range stuff, I'd be shocked. Wow, he does have some range stuff. Hot Zone Hunter. Yo, all right. Bazemore, Curry, Jermaine Jones is a must. Patrick Mills and Kelly Oubre. Let's check out that. Dad. That's low key too. Dad can't shoot. Zubac, seven foot. Can't. Yeah, nah. Yeah, those are the guys I would go. Ruby Rewards. Let's go. Never Tiago Twitter. Sarik is I. Uh, Sarik's and uh, Jalen Rose is cool. Mitchell Robinson can't shoot. Paul Pierce. Ricky Pierce is always freaking OP, bro. Ricky Pierce is one of them that you should scoop. Tim Hardaway Jr., another one you should scoop, man. The guy's wet. He has good defense as well. Um, 
not gonna lie, I do like Devontae Graham. He's really good. If you don't have a point guard, I would choose him as well. Brian Cook, 6'9", probably terrible. Whoa, he's juiced. Okay. I take that back. Brian Cook, power forward center. Um, if you don't have Kevin Durant, you're small, you're power forward. This is a very good card. Um, all right, so is Fournier. He can shoot as well. Terrible defense, though. All right, this is tough. How many do you need of these? Five of these? All right, ready? Tim Hardaway Jr. Ricky Pierce is a must. He's OP. Brian Cook at power. Fournier. And honestly, I would probably go Jalen. Even though his defense is pretty bad. It's between Jalen. Ron Harper's clamps, right? Ron Harper's pretty good. Honestly, he can't shoot, though. That ruins his card. Between Devonta and I would say Jalen. Yeah, that's what I think. Devonta and Jalen for the last five. All right, I'm with this. Here we go. Fred Brown, Bridgman, Serge Ibaka, Stefan Jackson. There's only five in here. So, best one's going to be Steven Jackson. This guy's always OP in 2K. He's always OP in 2K. Then I would probably say Serge. Then I'd probably say this man, Fred Brown. He can shoot very well. Steven Jackson just cheesy. Junior Bridgman's never eh. Bob McAdoo's definitely the worst one. No one likes this guy. He's just not it. He's just not it. I hate this card. And he's short. So I'm going Steven Jackson, then Brown, then Surge. Can Surge shoot? He probably can. Yeah, this Surge is a dog. Once we get there. Whoa, that's... How many tokens is that? 6 times 5, 30. And then 15 times 5, 60. You don't need a lot of tokens. You need like 100 to get to Abby. That's not a lot at all. Wow. That's pretty cool. And then we got Diamond. Kyrie, Eaton, oh wow, Jim Paxson could shoot, oh he, he really can't, alright, the worst one's Jim Paxson, Larry Kennan's really OP but he can't shoot, Mark Eaton, alright, it's gonna go Kyrie, ooh, Tom Chambers is really good, wow, alright, I'll go Kyrie, Tom Chambers, Mark Eaton, Mark Eaton's just a glitch, he's been a glitch forever, he can't shoot, he's just a glitch, then I'll go Paxson, then I'll go this guy, Really good on defense, though. That's why I like him. So, I don't know. It depends with him. He's a little he's a little all over the place. I would say he's pretty good, though. I would say he's pretty good. He's got defense. I'm a shooter. I like shooting. I don't really know. I like shooting more. So, Kyrie, Chambers, Eden. Literally down the list is how it would go, in my opinion. Pink Diamonds. Let's see. Oof. Oof. If Jerry Lucas has his jump shot from 2K20, he is hands down the best player in the game. Uh, that's period. If Jerry Lucas has his jump shot from 2K20, he is the best power forward in the game, guys. If you play 2K20, I ran Jerry Lucas on my 12-0 squad in, like, July. The man was a dog. Jerry Lucas, if he has the good jump shot. It's not even close. Next up, I'm going Money Mitch. Money Mitcher is just a dog. His defense is decent. He is a dog. Money Mitch is going to close out games. That's it. He's been good. He's a 2K13 legend, bro. So, money, Jerry Lucas, Money Mitch. That's what I'll go, the order. Brad D's last. I don't like Brad D. By this point, when you buy something, you get the pink diamond tokens. There's going to be shooting centers. You need shooting centers in 2K. Walt Frazier is also a dog. Clamp defense. These guys are big boys. These are huge rewards. Just depends. They're going to get outdated really quickly. I hope they don't. But these three are huge rewards, man. Huge. I really can't choose. Depends on the position, but these guys are huge. And then we got Dale Ellis, who's also huge. His defense lacks heavy, though. But he could shoot like a dog, and he probably has limitless range. Uh, He's got to have it. Catch and shoot. Blinders. I don't see any limitless range, unless it's like not in the game anymore. But yeah, he doesn't have it, so I don't know. Maybe there is no... I don't know. Maybe there is none. I don't know. I'm, maybe I'm just dumb. But yeah, that's what I think. Token market's also open for shoes and stuff. Free agents. Boosts. I don't know. Token market's a little weird. But yo, that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. That's the token market. I am not going to lie to you guys at all. My favorite token market player... Who was I just hyping up big time? My favorite token market player was on the Amethyst end, bro. Uh, or was it the Ruby? Oh, this dude's a dog. He's low-key really good. 
I really gotta say, bro. Oh my god, this Jerry. I wanna play with this Jerry Lucas. If he plays how he did in 2K20, oh my god, this card's juiced. But yeah, that's it. Hope you guys did enjoy. I really wanna play 2K. Let's get on band. Have a go, boys. Peace.